Welcome back to Curious Crafts. I'm here with Clover. Hi. <laughs> you stuck to the script. Uh, looks like we have a birthday cake here, doesn't it? There is no script. There is no script. It looks like it's a chocolate birthday cake, doesn't it? Look like, it, it looks, looks like sparkly. a burnt birthday cake. Well, very burnt. Uh, but this is our portal to the water plane. And I'm going to add some this iridescent shells to it. Well, it's getting to be fire. Yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. fire yet. Yeah. This is the uh, portal to the fire plane. Before you, we start and we get messy, yeah. I want to show what, then what I've done with the landscape for the fire plane, which is... Duh, duh, duh. Watch your head. Ah. This right here. It's 24 by 21-ish. And you can see I've made a lot of places for the lava and the lava flows. It's on a, a full one inch thick piece of foam insulation. I've dug it out. I will be posting soon a speed special of the carving and the painting part of it. This is coated now with Mod Podge. It's still damp in some areas. Mod Podge mixed with black paint. And what I was just telling Clover is the entrance Grab the entrance right there. What? This? Yeah, the portal. Hey, I'm making this. I know you are making it, but I'm showing you where I want it to go. The portal will be in and out. Hmm. Like right there. Oh. See how I've made that kind of a flat area? Yeah. Well, then why don't I just make a staircase? Well, that's what I was thinking. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. So she's going to make a staircase coming down from that. And that, this could be trimmed more. You could trim it down to here if you wanted. Like with the with the um, machine, yeah. With with uh, my proxon, so that's that'll be the entrance and the exit, into and out of the uh, fire plane. And if we have time today, maybe we can paint this with some of the red and uh. orange and yellow paint. But for now, I'm going to work on the water water portal. I've added it to a base, as you can see here, and I'm just going to add. Uh, some um, of these beautiful iridescent seashells to the side with a glue gun. Since you're not using the glue gun right now, I'm going to bring it over here. Yeah. I know, it's tangled up in our legs. Let's turn the camera the other other direction. Take it out of studio mode. There we go. Okay. Hey, Autumn. How you doing? I painted this yesterday at the end of the stream and it's still a little damp in the middle. I used a, did I bring it? I didn't bring it. I used a glue uh, that had sparkle in it, like a black one, but then I mixed it with some paint. So like it has glitter, a little bit of a glitter, glue, glue. glitter glue. Thank you. And actually what I was going to do before I put these gems on there, not gems, these, they're like seashell parts. I was going to paint the outside with this glitter paint. What do you think of that idea? Ooh. Yeah, ooh. We need a plate, another plate. Ah, oh, here we go. <laughs> Look, a plate. We are great. It's actually not bad here in the area. It is not too hot. So that's nice. It's cool down here in the craft studio, stream studio. So tell them what you're doing, Clover. I am carving out a hole to put the skull in, this little skull. Yeah, that looks so cool. I'm going to put it at the base of the portal. And right now I'm just... No, the top, the capstone. That's what I meant. You said base. Well, I meant top, all right. So, <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, I'm just carving out a hole to put the back of the head in. Okay. I can't see that, but yeah. I watched a little bit of our stream yesterday and realized every time... Oh, did you hear that? I did. It's like the paint farted. Yeah. And I realized every time we jiggled the, the table with carving and stuff, like this camera shaked. Whoop. Yeah, so Shuffle. we have to be careful. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and then I'll explain what I'm doing with these little spiky things here. Spike. I decided that the hellscape needed a, uh, instead of being so flat, it needed some movable scatter on it. And that scatter will be, uh, is it stalag? mites, right? Stalagmites come from the ground up I have and no stalactites idea. are from the ceiling down. Because of the T in tights, it's from the top. That's how I remember that. All I that. know is that you should not get a stalagmite. <laughs> I 
That's so funny. Oh wait, no need to mock me. <laughs> this doesn't look shiny yet, but it, when it dries, it'll be shinier. Oh, that's good. I like that. I might put it a little bit deeper. Deeper? Because it it's... It yeah, kinda it kind of sticks out it, a little bit. Yeah. But I wouldn't put it in yet. I'd paint it first. Oh, I know. I'm okay. just making sure yes. it fits. Yes, I think deeper is a better... I like it when it's, um, like, kind of buried in it. Not buried, but, you know. Engraved. Engraved in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And not just glued on. Or make it appear like it was just like an afterthought. Yeah. This was the first thing that they added. Yeah. <laughs> they built everything around Around this. it. Yeah. That's the skull of some fire god or something. Or the first Perhaps. enemy that the fire god defeated. I don't know. I'm gonna say it's the one who made it, but that wouldn't make any that sense. That wouldn't make any sense. You didn't say I finished up the rest of the, the scatter for the... Um, Night Serpent Temple. What? What'd you say? It's over there. I I posted pictures on Twitter today of the oh. Night Temple. Yeah, I don't look at Twitter. <laughs> the Night Serpent. The Temple of the Night Serpent. The Banana Brothers are probably gonna find themselves. Yeah, sparkly paint. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get a really a smaller exacto knife. You just jiggled the camera. Sorry. I'll hold it. Hold it. There. <laughs> Well, I just stopped it from shaking. Ooh. It looks very bright now, but that'll actually dry and just kind of be a, a this teal, aqua-y colored sparkle. And I think I'm going to actually do that on the inside here as well. This is from the fancy box of knives that I stole from Mom. <laughs> yeah, when you said I'm going to go get my exact knife, I'm like, whose exact knife? Yours. <laughs> Because the box cutter just won't do. It's too it's too big. It's bulky, yeah, I get it. I had an idea for the uh, the water. The plane of water. Yeah. The the terrain part, the ground part, instead of being actually underwater, make it like a sort of like the city of Atlantis where it's kind of in a bubble. Or what yeah. is that what is that place on Naboo um that Jar Jar Binks is from? No idea. Remember that city I know what you're talking yeah. about, but I don't know what it's called. Make it like that where it where it's underwater but it's not you know, you can go down there. But and you can breathe. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine. Okay. I just got my hand on the side of that. Oops. So I'm noticing. Yeah. This isn't. Well, no, it's fine. Okay. That looks cool. Hmm? Oh, yeah. I don't like that. Uh oh, where's the water? Oh, here it is. Alright, so now I'm going to glue the. The bits. Can they see you okay? You're not really. Let's get the overhead back on. Mm. Yeah, I think the overhead might be better. They, there, they can see you work better. Yeah. Working better. I kind of fixed the camera a little bit. I'm really excited about getting the stream studio reset up. How do you plan on setting it up? Well, um, like I said, the shelves are coming in to put the scatter on from the other room. Yeah. And. I want to rearrange the cameras so they're all hanging from the ceiling and more steady okay. than, you know, bouncing off the table like this one's doing now. Give myself more room to stream and to craft. Alright, what do you think of that? Oh yeah, that's good. I'm pushing it a little bit, but when it gets glued on it'll be... Okay, yeah. I might go a little bit deeper, but overall that's... Okay. Because if you see, that's where the line is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bury the bury the line, and then it doesn't look fake, you know? Yeah. I might go a little bit deeper, but overall, that's what I plan on doing. Okay. Where does it need to go deeper? Do you hear us okay, Autumn? Are we loud enough? I never know when this... I didn't change any of the settings from yesterday, so I assume. Uh, no. Oh, good. 
So what have you been up to, sweetie? Just uh, hanging out, doing some crafting, doing some artwork. I'm not even measuring these things. I'm just tossing them on. I know. Who am I? Okay, yeah, that fits. Yonk. Put it back in the magic box of knives. <laughs> Which is apparently a thing. Yes. Um, now what? Stairs? Yes, now build the stairs. And then... Oh, let's get a dark blue one <gasps> All down these there. bones are in my way. Yeah, move the bones. And then... Ow! As soon as you have the platform ready and the stairs ready, then... Um, you can paint it with the Mod Podge. I ordered more Mod Podge from Amazon because we were running out of it. I need the hot water box. Okay. Yep. Bring the props on over. I put it behind us so we could both reach it if we had to. You know what you should have? You should have like a jar where you keep all the tools in. That's, well, what, I have. That's what I have at my desk. My little Bet. makeshift crafting desk. That would be a great idea. We should totally do that. I'll find a jar. Ah. Everything's in my way. <laughs> I'm in my way. Ah. <laughs> Ow! Aw. This thing is sharp. Is it? Oh, the edge is? Yeah. yeah. That's okay. Uh, Ooh, I want to see. Are you posting the uh, pictures to your resin crafts on on uh, Discord or someplace? Because I'd like to see those. That sounds cool. I I have resin on my wish list. I want to try it. Oh, I've seen those. I've seen videos of people making stuff with resin. It's really cool. Yeah, I want to see. What they you've like done. add. They add like dried flowers and yeah. whatever else with it to it. Is that good? Or should I make it smaller? Like, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna let this straight across. You're, oh wow, you're doing it left hand? Uh, yeah. <laughs> let me just... <laughs> no, it's fine if you can do it left hand. I didn't. I guess I have to do it left hand, I no, don't you know don't. why. It'll fit in there. Just unscrew, unscrew this part. Nope, I've already, oh, okay. I've already committed to doing it left hand. Mm -hmm. Now I have to. Alright. Just remember, if you cut it too short, then you gotta start all over again. Oh, it's your materials. Well... Okay, and pick one out before the glue your dries. Hands, your hands are a bit off. So Thank you. I, which direction? Righty tighty, lefty loosey. Yeah, well. I need more out left. Here. I can't. There we go. Good gracious. <laughs> we don't have the biggest workspace here anyway. <laughs> yeah. Oh good, thank you. Yeah, I, I'm. She's looking at the at the OBS more Issue. often than I am. Yeah. Issue. Uh. Yeah, that's why I said you go from this side. Ah, uh, yeah. but. You know, don't listen to good old mom. Well, what do you know? Exactly. Why is it? There we go. You get it the distance you want, and you you've uh, a bit shorter, but I can it down. Always, yeah. Okay. Uh, That's so satisfying to cut, to watch cut, to listen to cut. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> that, that wasn't that wasn't my fault. Did it break? Oh, it melted the glue, and now it's. No, it's fine. Okay. Because when the wire breaks on that thing in the cut. mid, mid uh, cut, it freaks you out. Mm, yeah, it's, I would assume. Yeah, it it sounds like a guitar string breaking. I don't know what that sounds like. I can handle viola string breaking. I also don't know what that sounds like. Oh, I've, it's never, never broken? I've never broken a single string of mine. Wow, that's pretty. That looks good. What do you think? Yeah. It's very oceany. Yeah, I think I think this is a good height. Yep, very good. Just make the stairs now. Or the yep. platform and the stairs. Magic wire box. 
No longer needed. I'll need it soon, but... Okay. Well, I don't mean soon. I'll need it next. Yonk. So this... Actually, I'm gonna need that. I'm, I need that. A glue gun also? No, the box. <laughs> Do you put it back? <laughs> nice. Yeah. Okay, okay. So... <laughs> stairs. Ah, I keep picking ones I don't need! How about Gosh, that mom. one? So no. each step is this, is this thin, right? You have to think about, well, or thinner. Each step is... Thank you, Autumn. What? Each step is... Oh. She said it's very oceany. It pictures how high up a step can you can you go? Honestly? How, how high are our steps? Not you, long legs. <laughs> um, I'm like at like two feet A max. normal person. <laughs> well, I guess I wouldn't know then. Up, uh, a, up, a, up a flight of stairs. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? This is Me a measure a step? Uh, yeah, sure. I'm going to measure with it's probably eight the inches. cutting box. It's probably about eight inches is how... Eight inches? For well, a step? No, 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 but then now now translate that to D&D &D math. No, I know, but still. It would be... Well, how big is a step? I don't... I it's don't, not a half... It's not six... I don't go around foot. measuring our stairs. Well, maybe you should. Uh, I need a white one. Here we go. Ooh, that's a good one. Math. I was told math. there'd be no math I know. involved. Um, I would think max a foot, right? Yeah. So, so that's an inch. yeah. So what is <laughs> a, a fifth? Don't of, move your chair. A fifth of an inch. Uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> well, I think it's fine if you go with a quarter. I'm just gonna start cutting. Or just start cutting. I'm gonna try to use more of this aqua color, because I think it stands out more nicely. And, oh, I think I used the back end of that. Doggone it. Let's see if I can get that glue off. That's, that was the pretty side. I don't have sides, but... This one has dark, darker on the other side, sort of like a backing to it. Whereas this one has, you see more of the blue. I'm just, I'm realizing now that no one got to see that, and I'm so sorry. Oh, because it's very satisfactory. Yeah. We'll put it, slide it up farther. I don't know why, but every time I start streaming, my nose starts to itch. <laughs> <laughs> you laugh at me until it happens to you. I'm just itch my nose. I got no problem with that. <laughs> Are you gonna need this? It's <laughs> a super no, thin. No, 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 no. Go ahead and toss it. Uh, you know what? Uh, no. Until you until you itch your nose and it's got a bunch of paint on it, and then you go around the rest of the day with paint on your nose because you can't see yourself. Yeah. Some sacrifices you make <laughs> for your craft. I'm gonna use this little hair. Of styrofoam. Just make sure it's sturdy. That this these stairs are sturdy. Our adventurers are gonna stomp up them. They're gonna run down them in fear from what lies. They're gonna stomp up these quarter inch styrofoam steps. Yeah. Sounds like a them problem. <laughs> yeah. If they break them. So just make sure that you make the stairs. Well, like it, like it'd be made for a temple or or a a a, a planar location. Yonk. I'm probably gonna need this still. I have no idea what I'm doing. Well, plan it out. No. It's I'm... a good thing that we scripted this just right. <laughs> this isn't scripted at all. <laughs> you came down, you came down in here about what, fifteen minutes ago? Yeah, I said, Alright, what are we doing? You're some crafty. I'm like, alright, let's go. <laughs> I need to cut it this much. Okay. What measurement is that? Yes. Ooh, that one's This is pretty. off, right? Yeah. That's how. It is now, yeah. <laughs> Paint on the nose, yep. <laughs> okay, I need it. And then no one tells you. You just walk around with it all day. Everyone notices, but they don't say anything. It's like walking around all day with your tag out and your t-shirt. I hate that. I'm always fixing people's tags. Yes, I'm you like, are. I can vote for that. <laughs> like... <laughs> Oh, I have to warn you when I do it, because otherwise you jump. You're so ticklish. You know what? Ding! Let's dump more of these out. Ooh, that one's pretty. I'll use that one next. All it's right, too they big can the they spot. can see it this time. Yeah. 
Oh, no! What that... did you do, Ray? Uh, nothing. Uh, nothing. <laughs> that doesn't sound like nothing. It's, n it's, it's nothing. Did you screw it down so it's nice and sturdy? Yeah. Now you are. I see. Yeah, mm -hmm. It's okay. There can just be a slight area where it may have broken by accident. I have more styrofoam. No, I've already started cutting. Oh, okay. I hope one day you have a kid just like you. That would be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> you know, no. Measure twice, cut once. You're not. You just said yourself you're not even measuring. Well, apparently you need to. <laughs> 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 You're the one who slammed it down in indignation. Ah, what was Why do you keep a gallon of water under your desk? Because I use water for painting. That is a good point. All right. All right, it's fine. I can fix this. Okay, Where'd it good. go? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Oh, you slammed it down. Every time you jiggle the table, they're probably going, Oh, earthquake! Well, this is on the ceiling, so earthquake unless, I, on the unless I go upstairs and stomp really hard, they're not gonna- they're not, they're not, you're not gonna see anything. There we go. Ah! Ooh, now I can you put that big blue one there, because a lot of room for it right there. Yay! Oh, it's so pretty. How do you turn it up? This way? Is this up? Uh, uh, to the right, yeah. If, it's, if it starts smoking, you might want to turn it down. No. <laughs> it, as she says, as it smokes. <laughs> Uh-oh, it's starting to leak out. <laughs> I've, held it, I've held it up right too long. <laughs> the paint's leaking out. I need ta paper towel stat! <laughs> well, I made a square by accident, but I don't want to talk about it. Wait, why isn't it? But do you need do you need the um the T square thing to make it R ruler? No. <laughs> Apparently you do. Oh, I've gotten um about a third of the way around. It's starting to leak out. Oh no, I've missed the side. It started to leak out of. Talking about the the glue, the glitter glue that's in the middle. Gravity pulled it out, sort of leaking. That smells bad. You can see the glitter paint's already dried. You see, it's just that a little bit of glitter. And there's the. Ah. So uh, a fifth of an inch. What is that? Steve rule. I don't know. You can go with probably go with just do a quarter. I still need a ruler for that. Oh well, here I've got several of them lying around. Yonk. Do it so they can see. What's the point of streaming a craft if they can't see you streaming the craft? For my hysterical commentary, duh. <laughs> well, let me know when it gets hysterical. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Maybe I should just leave. <laughs> You're not gonna leave your project in my hands. I know you too well. Yeah. <laughs> what are you looking for? Yonk. Something. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Yeah, the smoke that isn't there smells bad. <laughs> There's no smoke. It smells terrible. <laughs> Yonk. Once again, you're slamming stuff down. It's- we're on the ceiling camera. Nothing's gonna happen. Oh. So when we do the- the earth and the, uh, what's the other one? Earth and wind? Yeah. Portals? Next week? Yeah. Which one do you want to do? Uh, air. Air? Oh, yeah. okay. What kind of ideas do you have for that one? Yes. <laughs> none. Absolutely none. <laughs> Need more of these out. Yeah. 
Now I can cut. I have measured well, let's, it. Well, let's brainstorm some ideas. I'm cutting. Are you too busy? You can only talk about one thing, the current project you're on. I'm just asking. All right, all right, fine, fine, fine. No, this is... Well, like, what ideas would you have to use to make the portal to the plane of air? Look, see, I'm going to engrave it. I'm going to cut this part out okay, a little show bit. show them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it, let's see. It's hard to see, but there's a, a rough outline right there. Yeah. That this block is going to... Uh, oh, it's fit right there? Yeah. I'll, I'll be I'll... inserted into it. Yeah, I see. and then I'm okay. going to cut it like stairs that way basically going you wanna, down you better cut it first before you attach it okay oh yeah 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 i'm not attaching anything okay no no glue is involved right now okay. at all good <laughs> so i have the glue over here what if i cut just like straight up like use the prox machine yeah and i just cut like just straight up cut it out entirely instead of making an indent if i just cut it out so it would fit yeah you could do that bet yeah, it's absolutely. A straight line, and is, um, I'm working. On Remember, a there's circle. some hot glue on on there, so it might just don't push it to through the proxon too forcefully, or you'll, you'll break the wire. We have more wire, but it's better to not break it while you're um, using it. Okay. Aww. Yonk. What? Well, is that okay? What? That right what? there. Yeah. What okay. about it? It just looks like it's not the pretty side of the rock. I think it looks great. Okay. You just wanted that rock to fulfill its destiny. Absolutely. It's crafting destiny. No rock left behind. This is on, isn't it? Oh. I yeah, I hear it. I turned it down too much. Yeah, it does make a louder noise when it's turned up. Okay. A more, little more than halfway done. Oh, I jiggled the camera. No, wrong camera. We're on a different one. Yeah, Mom. <laughs> I was thinking you could use, like, cotton. It's stuck. Or... No, you stay. No. What other... What other kind of, um... Materials would you use for a uh, air portal? The portal to the plane of air. See, I would say clouds, but honestly, clouds are water. Well, okay, yep, yeah, clouds would be perfect, but how would you create the clouds? That's what I'm getting at. Oh, cotton. What would the. Okay. And then you just. Yep. Okay. I gotta <laughs> cut more. <laughs> Ah, I can't find a good one. This is a good one. Oh, it's a little darker. I like that one. I think for Earth, I'm going to make it look like Stonehenge. Who? You know, that famous druidic circle. Made out of no, stacked yeah, stones yeah. in 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 uh, England. Oh, the circle of stones thing. I just didn't. I just say that. I mean, yes. But I'm just repeating you in a yes. different way. Yes. Stone. E fits. E. Look at that. Nice. Good job. Now I gotta cut it more. <laughs> it fits, but I have to cut it more. Mm. Although, like, look at that scene. Sort of make this make them look like um. It's weird because Columns. it's weird because here the corn like it matches up pretty well, but here yeah. it doesn't. No. No, oh, that's all right. Well, it how's it look when it's flat? That's good. You tell me. Yeah, looks all fine. Right, cool. Now, kind of pencil out how you're gonna put the the um, stairs on there. Oh, I messed that one up. That. There we go. Like, like, Mark, how are you going to get the stairs on? Where, where they're going to go? Or would you prefer another question? <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> it's not even. And I, I'm just staring at it. Oh, trying to will it to be even? Yeah. Good luck with that. Has it's it gonna... become even yet? Now that you're looking at it? No? 
No. <laughs> Look at that. I think it's fine. I don't. As your great nana would say, you wouldn't be able to tell from a trotting horse. <laughs> Autumn mood. <laughs> yeah. Brunk. Alright. Yay. Nah. I didn't want that on the base. I wanted it on the side. There we go. The idea around the water portal is to have these shells on the outside and then well, these shell parts, I should say. And then on this part have some green moss. You know, like greenery. Like, yeah. like a terrain greenery. And then up here... I don't know, maybe m more greenery? And I have some shells I could use. Get paint all over my Can I make each step five feet? I mean, an inch. You mean a quarter of an inch? No, each step. Like if it's an, if it's an inch, that's five feet in D and D world. No, remember? I know, I know, I know. I'm oh. saying not not the not the not the height. I'm saying oh. the length and width. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of each exactly. Step. That's exactly what they should be because of. That's what the, the squares. Yeah. Okay. Yonk. Yeah, they need to be an inch wide so the character, the um, minis, can go on them. That's the one thing I like to do with the terrain I make is to make sure that it's usable in game. Because what's the point, right? Yeah. I mean, it's pretty to look at, but it's more fun to play on. Yeah. I need dark blue. Oh, I'm missing some dark blue. Here's a good one. Oh, that fits perfectly right there. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> you're not even looking at that. Nope. So look at that. You're like not even looking up. I'm just imagining what it looks like. Oh, okay. It looks great. Thanks. This is the first time I think I've used these little bits in a project. If I remember correctly. Hmm. I might you know what I might have used them in the um terrain I made for the this flail snail terrain. I remember that. But I I've taken that apart since. Because I wanted to use it for something else, and the Banana Brothers have already passed the area where they would have come across a flail snail. Home, at least. A flail snail home. Seems kind of spe specific. <laughs> Easy for me to say. Yeah. For a, for a terrain, anyway. It's easier to make, or it's better, I think, to make terrain that can be used. Ooh, that one's cool. Like a round bead. No. Um, they can be used for all sorts of different parts of the game. For example, the the uh, terrain that I'm putting together that'll be on the opposite end of that portal to the fire plane could be used for a dragon slayer, a red dragon slayer, because of all the uh, lava and fire. Yeah. Or it could be uh, the base of a vo or the inside of a volcano. Yeah. <laughs> You're just gonna yeah me all day. Yeah. Yep. I do like these little pieces. There's there's such a variety. I haven't found any two pieces that are that are alike. Hmm. It's literally like they took these iridescent blue shells or sea glass. You know, that's what it might. That's what it reminds me more of sea glass, mm. not shells. And just crushed it. Yeah. Into little bits. <laughs> You're a woman of few words, aren't you? <laughs> yep. I sit here and talk to myself. <laughs> She's concentrating off the camera where no one can see. Oh, my bad. <laughs> no one can see the work she's doing. 
Yonk. Oh, it's a dark one. I don't like that one. Do you have any like shorter ruler? Because I'm only using like the first inch, and yeah, I got I got this thing over here just I, in my way. I actually need one. That's that needs to go on a, a wish list. Yeah, because it needs to be metal. Because when I use a um, wooden or plastic ruler with the sharp with a um, knife, it always cuts it up. That's that where it goes. Noisy. Well, all right, magic cutting box. Time. We're back on the magic cutting box. Yes. I guess I'll scooch over before it hits me in the back of the head. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a good color. Do you think this needs to have a capstone similar to what we did on the fire one? Like, try to take shells and make them the centerpiece of the edge? Oh, you... Like those really? those big shells. But if it's gonna be layered down, then unless the front of it is obvious, like it's obvious where there's an entrance, I wouldn't. Well, the entrance is basically dive in. Right. There's no like specific entry point no. like there is here because it's upright. You have to go in this way. Yeah. When it's like this, you could go in any direction you want. So there's there's That's no true. centerpiece except for unless you have like a thing above it. Well, I don't mean centerpiece to make it like. A directional centerpiece, I meant more like decorative, like this is the water plane and we've made it pretty. Ah, yes. Alright, it's really hard to see, but I've cut out, like, a, like I'm gonna make these into stairs, so I'm gonna cut it out here. Okay. And then, I'll, and then I will attach another block to add for uh, uh, more stairs. Okay. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Why doesn't it go in? You are having so much trouble with the props on. Yeah, it doesn't like me. I don't think it does. Ah! Well, there stop we being so derpy with it. No. I've got all these little ghost threads hanging off the glue gun now. Hanging off my project. What if you left them there? Then it just looks like a spider attacked. Exactly. Oh, no, no, no. here. So! Welcome to day two of planes, portals to the elemental planes. Of Kujara trying not to regret the fact that she invited me. <laughs> <laughs> That's alright. It's no fun to craft alone. It's more fun to craft with somebody. Even if we're sharing a four foot space. <laughs> all right. I will sit here and peel all the wool. And my fingers are all blue now because the whole thing was painted blue and I was touching it all over. There's the, the edging around the portal to the water plane. It's got a really pretty sea glass edge all the way around it. And then I was thinking, here, I'll show you what I was thinking. These are real shells. Oh, you're concentrating. You don't have to look. I wasn't going to. You weren't going to look or concentrate? Uh, yes. <laughs> oh, no. Crap. It's fine. And create, like, a decorative element. Sort of like, like that. On one edge of it. Yeah. I'm going to turn it to the other camera. Sort of like that. What do you think of that, chat? Let me know. And I could always paint these with a glitter paint to kind of keep the same, uh, you know, look. Not blue glitter, because that's too much blue, but black glitter. I do have black glitter. I don't doubt that. You like that? Is that a good idea to make that sort of like the... It's gonna look better with the green on it, first of all. I think this will be the gr this will be green area also. And yeah, yeah. I think I do have some silver glitter. Yes, you're right. Okay, so let me clean this mess up. We'll go back to the overhead because you can see Dooflachi over here. Hey, that's not my name. And her cutting. 
cutting of the... <laughs> it's good, though. Thanks. That's the way to do it. Nice and easy. And then, that's right, and then turn it off when it's, when you're not ready to go. Hmm, butthead. Oh, did it mess up? That's all right. No, but it, it messed up the right way. It, yeah, I see that. It went you, out. You, you can fix it. Yeah, you can fix that. Yes. So I'm going to get some greenery, which is going to cause a huge mess. Yeah. And add it oh. to the um, outside. I don't want to bump you. You're fine. Well, I have to get over here and I'm not skinny enough. Oh, look at that. I did. Congratulations. Thank you. Pardon me, excuse me. Pardon me, excuse me. All right, so I've got this moss that you cut. It's peel and stick. The only thing I'm not that crazy about is this for some reason, the first time I used it, it was great. It looked great on all the projects I put it on. And then the next time I bought it, it's like they, they they went cheap on me. And it's thinner. You can almost like see the grid through it. Yeah. She's mesmerized by a piece of the... Look at that. Look piece at that. of the foam that came off of it. And it stopped focusing. Whatever, it's fine. But it, it's cool, I promise. <laughs> So, that can be. That's kind of cool. Yeah, no, no, no. We'll rough it up. Okay. Okay. So I made this with this this pattern, sort of same pattern I used for for that ish. So I'm gonna use this to cut my piece of. <laughs> there really is no room here for us. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I can I can move this. It's okay. That's all right. I'm just laughing because it's funny. All right, I need this much, and then I need some around the edge too. So I'm actually gonna make this bigger. Okay, we got the beginning of our steps. I've cut uh, one step. Uh, yeah. Excellent. Break time. What? <laughs> <laughs> There's no break. <laughs> We're not taking a break here. Yeah. yeah. This stuff gets everywhere. I need a vacuum down here. Yeah. It is between the between all the bits of foam that have scattered all over this uh, basement floor. Somehow. Not, not somehow. I know exactly how I did it. <laughs> and look at all this. Look at all this that's appeared. Oh, oh no. All the greenery. Mm -hmm. There we go. <laughs> no space, no breaks. <laughs> All right, Crafting so, in hard mode. Exactly. So, that's about right. I will use a pencil for this part. Now the problem with um, doing this, using this stuff on pieces that are already cut out that are not completely circular, is you have to use. You can't really cut using the pattern because then this is the opposite side. I know I just blew your mind with that, so uh, that's all right. We don't talk about it. Yeah, I heard what you did. Uh huh. <laughs> I cut the um, the square a little larger than I needed because it's going to go used to cover these other bases right below the, the stone pieces. Okay, I gotta cut it like that. Okay. I'm talking to myself. Okay. Now this one... I'm actually going to fold it in here. What do you need? It's like a really, really thin bezel. Just this one. It's not really thin. Take this bark off. I'm going to fold this in half. Just 
gonna kill my hand, but that's all right. I'm used to it. All right, I'm using a pen. Okay, I can trust a pen. That's a lie, but you know. <laughs> Pens are not trustworthy? Nope. All right. Uh, yeah, this is okay because the water's gonna come up to the edge, and that's okay. This stuff is very sticky, by the way. Yikes. Okay. You ready for this fun part? I'm just not gonna look. <laughs> I'm only gonna unstick part of it because it is very sticky. And place it on and peel as I go. Oh, this is this is good stuff. This is the better. I lucked out. I got a, another good batch. As you cannot see through that part. Now it's stuck there. Let's see if I don't mind. There, now I know exactly what to cut. No secrets. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh, a lot of paper's ripping up like that. You see, I've made it rough here along this side. It's hard to tell since I've painted it, but it's not perfectly flat, and that's so I can push uh, the um, greenery down onto it and give it a little bit of um, texture. The other thing I'm doing is, and this is really cool, the reason this stuff works so well is because you can stretch it as you apply it to fit the way you want it. So I'm not actually pushing it down along the sides near the rocks that I've made because I wanna pull and push it in ways that it doesn't look so set. I'm gonna give it a little bit of a little bit of a lip there along the edge of those rocks as I go, those um, sea glass and not bury them under a perfectly circular piece of A really good one. I've gotten some cheapy ones before and they just don't look as nice. I'm pulling this too to make it fit to the edge. And it's okay if, it, if you have some blank spots because I have extra that I can lay down around any parts I might have missed. And boy, once that's down, it's not coming back up. There we go. It's still a little wet from the, the glitter glue, the glitter paint. There, and now we have our second or slash third step excellent which needs to other way around yeah oh perfect yeah step. that's what i wanted yeah all right so this isn't done yet but so far what do you think of putting the shells then on there yeah like that oh i like that yeah sort of the uh very um watery all right let me get the outside of this done too i don't need the plate anymore and since it is so sticky i might do a section at a time because if i if i if i put that on there that's gonna stick to the tablecloth yeah. so i think i will do a section at a time. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> what are we having for dinner tonight? Uh, we had junk last night. We should have something decent tonight. Of course, I have nothing to frost it, so. Pizza. <laughs> That's not that's not decent. That's just pizza. Maybe not for you. <laughs> we had junk last night. We could you wanna do appetizers? Yes. I don't think you've ever said no to appetizers. No oh, no. <laughs> we've got uh I think we have picked in a blanket. I haven't had those in a while. Okay. That would be very much out of It <laughs> Sells like pizza Wait a second. Actually no, that's fine. Okay. Yay! Don't you love it when you do it right? Yeah. Oh, it fell off. But it's okay. Yeah. <clears> that <throat> missed a whole section there, but that's alright, because I can just add some more. The nice thing about this stuff is that you can overlap and you can't tell the seam or anything. I mean, you can if you really try. Mm. But then again, who really tries? Who really tries, right? Well, the nice thing is, is since it's on the camera, when you're, you know, playing, yeah, ah, yeah. <laughs> uh, where's that pen? Because it does work better than the pencil for this. Yeah. Um, you really can't tell on on the camera. So since I use this for my online games, it's hard to tell. Nah. Okay. We're um, playing um, Wordsters on tomorrow night's trivia game with the family. Ooh. Do you know what Wordsters is? It's no. one of my favorite games. Not at all. I play it with license plates all the time, so you know what I'm talking about. Oh, oh you take letters, you try to make a word out of it? Yeah. Cool. But there's actually a real a real game that I forgot we had. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know, I marked that, and then I didn't cut it. I just peeled the paper off. I'm not paying any attention to myself. I know this is going to be a really sticky job in a second. So I don't want to waste this Pen. underneath it. Hang on. Okay. Oh, my scissors are stuck to it. Oh, no. It's okay. I got it. Oh, okay. Here you go. Oh! <laughs> that got oh, that's just sprayed all <laughs> over her legs. And you're wearing shorts, I too. Know. Have fun with that. That's all right. I had a gap there to fill in anyway. This will come off the scissors using a rubbing alcohol and a scouring pad. I do like how this is turning out. I like the fact that it's a water entry, but it's it's got the natural grass around it too. Okay, I'm almost done with this part. I'm just gonna go ahead and trim this now while I'm thinking of it. Yeah. <gasps> Thank you, Sal. That's why it was doing that. All right, cool. Why? Uh, no, you didn't set the, you didn't. Oh, I know you didn't do. Cell is one of my players on my international game. Oh, okay. I used to call it British Invasion, but now I've got... Is Cell the Canadian or the Aussie? She's the Canadian. Got it, got it. I've got two Brits, a Canadian, and a... Whoops. And an Aussie. And a what? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they, need, they still need to come up with a group name, though. I like... Um, I forget what we said. Mayhem and Misfits or something like that. <laughs> Magic and Misfits. Pardon. Cell says hello. Ah! 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 Okay. I got it. And, um... You so have Canada modes? That is so cool. <laughs> I'm building a staircase. Styrofoam staircase. That looks good. Thank you. Oh, I just stuck my fingers in the paint. <laughs> Trying to save... <laughs> this is so sticky. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. The things I do for my players. 
So Cells had the privilege, I guess, what? of playing on some of my terrain that I've built. Awesome. Well, through... Because because they play on the... Um, well, through stream, though. Through stream. Yeah, that's what I meant. But they but they just said online D&D with actual terrain is so different to playing online with just a rough grid map. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> Look at this. I, this is like, my fingers are glued uh -huh. glued to the terrain now. Well, the, the terrain's glued to you. You know, Do you know why that, that smoke is bad, smells as bad as it does? It's because there's glue on it. Oh. Oh, well. I gotta get the vacuum down here. Yeah. Okay. Oops, let's get it over the glue. Smick. I'm gonna get that out of there. I don't want grass inside the water. My idea was to have it be like clear water. Yeah. Not clear, but um, unspoiled water. There. Okay. So now we need to add more water. Hey, look, it's the last step. I gotta make it smaller, though. But it's the last step. All right. Like, literally, the last step. <laughs> no, you still have to paint it. Huh. I'm gonna make three portals to your one portal. But yours will be the best. I thought I was making the air one. Or am I not doing that? Well, you have to finish that one first. All right, you know what? <laughs> we only have an hour a day on these things. I just need that. If you want to, you can work on it off stream. No, I'll just do the one. All right, that's fine. I'm just gonna have to dig my fingers in there. All right, let's get the. We have like two minutes. I'm gonna grab the clear paint uh, glue, which is oh, uh, where did I put the clear glue? <laughs> Somewhere. It is over there. I'll grab it. I'd show you guys the stairs, stairs, but they're not. They're all in different pieces, but I'm sure. Well, yeah. I yeah, hold on. <laughs> I'll yeah. There's so okay, many pieces. So I use really clear glue. Thin which I need more of. Look at that's all I have left. And even though that part's not completely dried, I'm gonna go ahead and put another layer in. I'm not gonna fill it all the way up. It doesn't look right when you do that, but I am gonna put another layer in. Yeah. Ooh. Let me take the cap all the way off first. That one's hard to get out. Looks like a small layer of glue. It does, but I don't want to get glue on them. All right, so I've made the stairs. Now I'm gonna let's put on the side camera so you can see that from the side. Oh, uh, let me move the magic box of cutting. Magic box of cutting. Every every time I'll give it a new name. Man, I forget the other one. Proxon. Remember, this is the Proxus. Nah, it's the wire styrofoam cutting machine. Wire uh, wire styrofoam cutting machine. There. Well, let's get it in the screen. It's stairs. Oops, I messed it up. Ah! Pen! Pen's gone! I'll get the pen. Don't worry. Don't panic. Don't panic. Panic. There! That's good! Eey. And then the skull? Where's the skull? Yes. Where'd that- what did I just drop? I don't know. Oh, clip. Hair clip. We'll go right there. And you, you were gonna use bones somewhere too, weren't you? Probably. <laughs> Thank you, Sal! Yeah, it does. I love it. Yuck. And we'll rough up the stone. You know, we'll make it look like Ow. it's actual stone. Yeah. All right. Uh, that was me at the table. Sorry. <laughs> yep. The camera just shook violently. Look <laughs> at the caps covered with green stuff now. Yikes. All right. Just a little bit of glue. It takes a long time. Thank you, Autumn. For that to um to dry and then it kind of dries up and 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 kind of sucks it in yep. and it gets shallower so that's why you don't want to fill it all the way out because then it just doesn't look right so, so you have to do a little I, bit at a time what do i do what do i do next do i just paint it all you know what maybe you should do that off screen so that it'll be ready to do next because we only have three more days to get all three portals oh fixed. and it is five o'clock yeah oh that was perfect i know i don't so, want this so we'll get, why don't you paint yours, or I will, off stream with the Mod Podge to give it that um, 
uh, sealant. You want to get that sealer on there. Yeah. And uh, let's see how it looks with the map before we close out. How about that? Okay. With the terrain. For those who missed it at the beginning of the stream, we had the terrain. Mm -hmm. The base. Told me to move. Yeah, move that. Ah, bones. I ah! Did, I didn't get a chance to work on the other. I was gonna. I have to make more of these spiky things to hang, to come out of the ground like that. So that goes. Oops, yeah. There. Yeah. Either either way. Well, now I have to put it on the other camera. Or you could just move it. Yeah. <laughs> There's no room to move it. Put it back over here so they can see it. <laughs> no, this. Oh. <laughs> it's off the camera. There. That looks good. Thank you. Good job. So that'll be the entrance to the the fire plane. Yeah. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for joining us today. Clover and I will be back next. You're joining me next week? Uh, yes. To work on it some more? I have to now. Next Wednesday? Yeah, she's sort of committed at this point. And um, we'll see you next week. If we don't see you before that, on Tuesday with the Banana Brothers. Oh, I won't. What? You have to say, yeah, D&D with the Banana Brothers. Go yeah. team. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, everybody. <laughs> Bye.